we're going to talk about the uh, Doctor Doom Kang fiasco. So we all got the news about Jonathan Majors. Everybody's, you know, trying to wonder what should we do? Do we recast this guy? You know, who can we find to replace him? Well, it is the multiverse, right? Everybody's been telling us about the multiverse and how the multiverse works and how, you know, um, you know, certain people can be different in the multiverse. They don't have to look the same. Doesn't really matter. You know what I'm saying? It's just it's the multiverse, man. That's like that's how it works. That's why we have like John Krasinski, Mr. Fantastic. And then we can slaughter him on screen. It's no big deal. We can then recast with um, Pedro Pascal because that doesn't, you know, it doesn't really matter. It's a different universe, right? It's a different universe. That's what they are. They're always fucking telling us about this different universe. So I found the perfect candidate for King because it's a different universe. It's not a big deal, dude. It's it, They're also, they're make-believe characters, dude. Make-believe characters, they don't matter, you know? It doesn't really matter, like what they look like in the comics or anything like that, right? So, who I found was a, he's a little known actor. Nobody really knows him much. But, you know, I think he would be the best Kang replacement. I say go with the Kang thing. I think it's a great idea because Kang is very essential to the MCU. And Jonathan Majors did such a great job, you know, making Kang look like a clown. He who remains. I mean, it was just awesome, man. So I think we should recast Kang with uh, Mr. Jimmy Shergal. You guys know who Jimmy Shergal is? Yeah, I didn't either. But you know what? Jimmy Shergal is a, uh, he's an Indian actor. He looks very much like Pedro Pascal. And Pedro Pascal is going to be our new Mr. Fantastic, you know? And Mr. Fantastic is a member of the Fantastic Four. His name is Reed Richards. And he has a, a distant relative known as Nathaniel Richards. And Nathaniel Richards is Kang the Conqueror. So why not? I mean, we're setting up, man. I mean, we got the X-Men coming, Fantastic Four. This is like Disney greatness. You know what I'm saying? So let's get prepped. Let's get prepped for the next reboot. You know, we're going to have Secret Wars, you know, all that great shit. So let's get prepped for, for phase or for reboot one, whatever you want to call it. And let's get Jimmy, man. Jimmy Shergal as Kang. It's a different universe. He doesn't have to look like Jonathan Majors. You know what I'm saying? We need Indian representation. How many Indian actors are in the MCU? And I feel like, I mean, there's lots of Indians that are, in, that are migrating and coming to the United States. I feel that they need proper representation, you know, and they got to be able to see themselves in a movie. So why not? This is a perfect opportunity. You can set it up for your next run. You know, we can get Mr. Fantastic all set up. It'll be a great great showing man i'm telling you it's a great idea dude i think we should definitely go with that and we have i have another great casting dr doom bro we are gonna cast dr doom they're gonna be one of the best dr dooms you've ever seen man i'm telling you it's the marvel way man. this is like doom to the fullest man i know everybody i know all all the disney shills are gonna be so excited i know they loved for this actor and that is who we are going to cast as Dr. Doom. I mean, if they do this, I'm telling you, man, we, you have to embrace the MCU. I, there's these new there's these new rumors going on, you know, like it's all Sony's fault. It's not really the all new, all different Marvel, Kamala Khan, any of them. Like that's not the MCU's failing, guys. I mean, anyone who thinks that is probably bigoted. You know, you guys are probably very narrow minded. Um, you don't understand, you know, what's going on here in the, in the pop cultural realm. And we got to embrace what's coming, man. It's the full on MCU. With, uh, Mr. Uh, Kevin Feige, bro. I mean, he gets all the credit, dude. It's all him. He's the greatest. Whenever something fucks up, there's something wrong. It was Sony's fault. They didn't sign Tom Holland, you know, so it's, it's not really Kevin Feige's fault. It's not his fault that people didn't like Brie Larson. As Captain Marvel, you know, my kids who love Miss Marvel, they both fucking hate Brie Larson. I mean, it's not Kevin Feige's fault, you know, that was, it, that's the casting director's fault, even though the casting director, Sarah, Sarah Haley Finch, she's done a great job casting most of the characters. Uh, and then it's, Ch it's Chadwick, Chadwick's fault for dying, you know, I mean, it's not, they couldn't recast the Black Panther, you know, I mean, it's not like Chadwick Boseman, who fucking loved and put his heart and soul into the character, he wouldn't want that character around for other, like, black kids to, like, look up to and see themselves as, you know, I mean, why would we do that? You should put him in a vault, don't recast him, but I've got the perfect Doctor Doom. 
I know he's supposed to be Latvarian, he's supposed to be a guy and, and, and all that, but I mean, really, bro, I think the best thing to do, it's a fan favorite, dude, as long as it says Star Wars or Marvel on it, Doctor Doom, right there, we got Doctor Doom, Shin Hadi, everybody, I mean, we got people with cardboard cutouts, I mean, this is just a, the representation of the dark side and Star Wars and everything that's great, Victoria Von Doom, you know, I mean, Victoria will do awesome uh, to say, this is the savior right here for the MCU, I'm telling you, dude awesome she was a she's like darzana you know what i'm saying i mean even though i've 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 never read about darzana you know she's a girl and she's a, a dark side sith so she's got to be as good as darzana you know what i'm saying i mean and then ray ray stevenson was darth bane you know i mean he, even though he didn't look like darth bane he didn't act like darth bane he's in the wrong time period for darth bane i, I mean i think that would be great and then look look at her in a hood look at that now put a doctor doom mask on her this is this would be amazing we get the representation who care it doesn't matter if it's a popular character we did it with the ones that nobody cared about let's do it with the ones everyone cares about that's the whole point of why we're doing the representation thing you know you're not going to make you're not going to make karma gay i mean karma was gay in the comics uh, for new mutants but she wasn't that popular so instead we made wolfsbane gay because you know that's just the better thing to do right so let's go with shin hottie Whatever her name is, this actress from Ukraine. She's Ukrainian, too. Everybody can post Ukrainian flags. They can get all excited. And Ukraine, Ukrainian, is kind of like Latvarian, Latveria, you know, Dr. Doom. She's kind of in the same region of where Latveria would be in the real world. So now you're getting representation, like, in the area where Dr. Doom's from, you know. And I, and I realize, you know, hardcore Dr. Doom fans are going to probably be upset, but, I mean... What are they bigoted or something like that? Are they sexists? You know, I mean, it's it's Doctor Doom, dude. Everybody loves Doctor Doom, and you know, he, he could totally work as a chick, dude. I mean, it's 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 not really that far fetched. I'm telling you, man.